Taking a look at our economy this morning, we know that uh, the rate of everything, the price of everything has just skyrocketed. Inflation slowing just a bit in April after seven straight months of relentless gains in inflation. The Department of Labor reports that consumer prices in April jumped 8.3 percent, though, from the same time last year. So this morning, Fox 17 News' Jackie Del Pilar sitting down with a financial expert about when we might be out of the woods and what we can all do to survive in the meantime. Staggering numbers at the gas pump, rising grocery bills, and inflation rates hovering near historic highs. Finance expert Andrew Winnett says it's a difficult time for people's wallets. We're still struggling. In fact, a lot of the middle class Americans are having a hard time making ends meet right now. Winnett is a business owner and financial advisor. He says the first thing families should focus on right now is lowering their debt. And if you do have debt, make sure that you get rid of it as fast as possible because interest rates are going to continue to go up, which means the cost of servicing your debt is going to become more and more expensive. He also suggests building and maintaining an emergency fund with at least six months worth of savings. This is just in case Fluffy gets sick or your car breaks down or your heating air goes out. But it's also if you find a really good deal, maybe there's a good real estate deal. Maybe there's a good business that you can pick up. And he says in both good and bad economic times, it's important to take ownership of your finances. No one else is going to help you. No one else is going to save for your retirement. No one else is going to live within your means. So you got to do it for yourself. Don't play the blame game. When it predicts inflation rates will remain high for at least the next nine months, he says it's important to live within your means to come out stronger as the economy improves.